Welcome to St. Paul's uh, Midday Time of Prayer. Uh, this is Dear in Holy Week. Today is Tuesday, April the 7th. We're glad that you've joined us. We're using a model of reading and praying that's called Lectio Divinia. Uh, it's a type of discipline where we weave the, both of those disciplines together, reading and praying. And so when I read the scripture, if there's a phrase or a word or an image that comes to your mind, stay there and allow the Holy Spirit to minister to you. Uh, what we will do is we will read the scriptures, then there will be a time of reflection and then a time of rest. We'll do that a couple of times in our time together. Today's passage is from the Gospel of Mark, Mark chapter 11, verses 28 through 31. One of the teachers of the law came and heard them debating. Noticing that Jesus had given them a good answer, he asked him, of all the commandments, which is most important? The most important one, Jesus said, is this, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind, and with all your strength. The second is this, love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. And now a second reading. One of the teachers of the law came and heard them debating. Noticing that Jesus had given them a good answer, he asked him, of all the commandments, which is the most important? The most important one, said Jesus, is this. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind and with all your strength. The second is this, love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. And now our final reading. One of the teachers of the law came and heard them debating. Noticing that Jesus had given them a good answer, he asked him, of all the commandments, which is most important? The most important one, said Jesus, is this. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. The second is this, love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these.
Throughout the rest of this day, I hope that you will continue to allow the Holy Spirit to minister to you as you continually reflect upon that word or that phrase or that image. As you do so, may the God may God bless you. Amen.